Hi boys and girls and welcome back to Yoga and a Story. So today we're doing another story using yoga poses. Um, this story is called I Am Peace and we are going to use our yoga cards to help us tell the story with our bodies. Okay, so whenever the time comes, I will show you the picture and you will do that pose with your body and hold it for as long as you possibly can. And then we'll just keep reading and we'll keep learning and growing and doing more poses. So I Am Peace by Susan Birdie. There are times when I worry about what might happen next and what happened before. The thoughts in my head are like rushing water, and I feel like a boat with no anchor. Everybody get into boat pose. Try to pick up those legs and hold the pose for as long as you can. So he feels like a boat with no anchor. Being carried away. Look at what's happening there. Where does he wind up? I give myself a moment. I take a breath. Everybody take a breath. Let it out. Good job. And you could bring your legs down if you're still in boat pose. And then I tell myself it's all right. I feel the ground beneath my feet and steady myself. Can you steady yourself in warrior pose? Arms out like a T. One leg in back, one leg out front. Good job, hold that there. I start to notice the here and the now. My thoughts begin to settle. My mind begins to clear. I am peace. Can everybody get into mountain pose? Both feet really well put on the ground, legs nice and long, hands together at your heart center. Good job. I can watch my worries gently pop and disappear. I let things go. So there's all his thoughts and he's letting his thoughts go and as he lets them go, they pop and they disappear. I can say what I feel inside out loud. I know myself. I can share kindness with others. I make a difference. How is he making a difference here? What's he doing? Feeding the birds, right? Oh, and look what's happening to the seeds. Where did they go? Falling right onto the ground. What do you think might happen to those seeds that fell on the ground? Hmm. <gasps> Look. What's happening? Yeah, something's sprouting. I wonder what it will be. <gasps> it's a tree. I can hug a tree and thank it for its beauty and strength. I connect to nature. Okay, you know what that means. Get into tree pose. One leg up, it doesn't have to be that high. As high as you can get it is okay. Try to balance on one foot and then switch legs and balance on the other. Beautiful job. I can watch the clouds make shapes against the sky. I know wonder. Can everybody get into bat pose? Lay flat on your back with your legs up in the air as straight as can be and try to hold it for as long as possible. I can taste and smell and touch and hear what is all around me. I use my senses. I can feel my breath fill my whole body. I tune into me. 
Everybody close your eyes, put your legs down. Close your eyes and take a big deep breath in and let it out. Good job. Now the water is still. I have found my anchor and everything is all right. I don't need to worry about before or after. I am in this moment. I am peace. Now I share my peace with others and hope that it is carried away to those who need it. And I dream we are peace. Sit up nice and tall, close your eyes, take a big deep breath in and let it out. One more time in, let it out. And I would love to hear you tell me something kind you can do for someone today. So that means somebody in your house, whoever you live with, it could be your dog, it could be your cat, it could be yourself. Something kind that you're going to do for someone today. Think about it and just do it. You are such brave boys and girls. I am so lucky to get to teach you. Have a beautiful day.